Hey what's up guys, it's Kazoo here and welcome to episode 70 of Skin Into Glory and uh, as you probably have noticed I haven't really been uploading the last couple of days, um, I'll get back to that in a second but uh, yeah, you can see on the screen the 5 star skiller we are going to be building a team around is Yasin Shikawi who looks absolutely awesome with 5 star skill moves and 5 star weak foot of course. Uh, we move to the challenges, uh, the first one is score 12 skill goals, the second one is score 3 different free kicks and with different free kicks I mean like not 3 power free kicks or something. Uh, you can see all the options on the right hand side where it says a uh, power free kick, a uh, curve free kick, under the wall free kick etc. Uh, the third one is score a hat trick with Shikawi, the fourth one is score a long shot, the fifth one is score 15 goals with Shikawi and the sixth and final one is win 10 games. So uh, those are pretty much the challenges, uh, now we're going to move on to the team, it is in the 4-3-3. Uh, and then the fourth variation in goal we have Tim Howard there from Everton awesome goalkeeper in this year's ultimate team really really like him uh, then we have Bessler there from I think uh, Kansas City there in the MLS uh, awesome player as well alongside Opara the in four version with 87 pace 74 defending and 82 physical for a, uh, for a silver that is pretty insane uh, then we move to the right back that is uh, Maxi Pereira there from Benfica uh, also an in form looks pretty okay for a right back to be honest uh, left back is second in form Ricardo Rodriguez from Wolfsburg looks awesome as well uh, also has decent free kicks I think so um, yeah hopefully we can score at least one free kick with him that would be nice uh, then we move to the center mid that is uh, by Rami there from HSV and uh, he looks awesome for a nonner with 75 pace 78 defending and also 82 physical he is sort of the, the defending midfielder I guess uh, then the center attacking mid we have uh, Cimento there from Zurich who is uh, I think an underrated silver I've used him quite a few times before to link up with Chikawi and I actually really really like him uh, then we move to the other center mid that is uh, Pizzi also from Benfica with four star skill moves and looks like a pretty decent uh, player as well uh, then a the right winger that is uh, man of the match Karesma could have gone with his in form but uh, he uh, actually got a man of the match a couple days ago uh, which is obviously the reason why I wanted to use him and uh, if you're wondering why I am actually using him um, I actually packed him like really really early on into the skill into glory series so uh, that is why we actually can use him looks absolutely awesome uh, then a striker that is of course sort of the main man in the squad that is uh, Yasin Shikawi 44 games 33 goals 11 assists and um, yeah all I can say is that he's just amazing in this uh, in this game uh, I cannot wait to use this uh, in form in the skill into glory series uh, which we actually are uh, going to be doing after we've of course uh, completed all the challenges with this squad and then the left winger we have uh, Ben Altier from the Bundesliga with four star skill moves and five star weak foot so um, this is pretty much a team um, as always link will be in the description down below so you can check it out yourselves but um, yeah as you probably have noticed and I have told you guys before in this video um, I did not upload I think for three days or something and it was mainly because I was trying to record for skill into glory I was trying out some squats and stuff but I played so so bad and it was just ridiculous how bad I played like I think I lost like five or six games in a row which I never usually uh, never usually had before so um, yeah I just decided to stop playing for a day then I tried it the day after and I know it's the same and I was just I was it was driving me crazy because I was trying to record a video for you guys but it was just not allowing me I don't know what it was but I was playing so so bad um, and I was actually not playing with this squad because I usually try out some squads that you guys sent me in and I was trying out this squad in the 4 5 1 formation. Um, it, uh, it looks really really awesome with Inform Ribéry, uh, Inform Shakiri and stuff, Inform Shar as well. But when I played with this team, when I played some test games with it, I just played so so bad like I said. And I just decided to just stop playing FIFA for I think like two or three days or something. I just couldn't be asked to play FIFA anymore. That was sort of the main reason why I wasn't uploading any any FIFA videos. Uh, I'm sure of it that you guys have probably experienced the same kind of thing uh, before. But for me, it was pretty much the whole week which uh, which annoyed me the most. But anyway, it's uh, luckily going a little bit better now. So um, yeah, that's why I'm actually uploading today. But I just want to let you guys know that I just don't want to upload like really really bad videos with bad gameplay and stuff just for the sake of uploading I would rather not upload for two or three days and then have like a, a good video the next day or something because I just I just hate it simply that's just how I am but uh, anyway we're gonna move on to the gameplay you can see it right there we had a pretty big chance there with the uh, Chikawi after a nice skill run uh, we came up against sort of I think a Dutch team a lot of silver
over players as well and uh, mainly in the first half we had a lot of chances here as well some nice stuff with Karesma from a corner uh, unfortunately we couldn't get a shot in uh, we tried to get it back there but you can see right there I don't know how that was not a foul but um, yeah anyway we continue on 31st minute we have uh, Chikawi on the ball you can see from the gameplay as well it was a little bit laggy from time to time which was annoying because it sort of ended up me failing a lot of skill moves but um, yeah we continue on uh, the 33rd minute he got himself a chance there as well a header with Kishna at the back post which uh, just went wide so we had a pretty big chance there for him as well but then just before of time we have the ball at Cimento and uh, we actually do pick up a free kick which uh, was close uh, to the goal I decided to switch it to Karesma and actually decided to go for an under, -wall, under the wall free kick which is a free kick I don't think I've scored so far I can see right there we were really really close uh, even though it went off target his defender almost put it into uh, into his own net so um, yeah anyway we continue on into the second half we have uh, Shikawi on the ball there nice spin to cut inside to be two defenders and we make it 1-0 to uh, to pick up the first goal with Shikawi and also sort of pick up the first skill goal I guess since we uh, since we beat two defenders in a row uh, then we continue on 69th minute we have again Shikawi on the ball a nice shot there with his weak foot which his goalkeeper just saved so uh, also in the second half we uh, recreate a lot of chances but it was sort of us uh, having a little bit of a problem with finishing off our chances uh, then we have the ball with Karesma we lose it he goes on the counter attack straight away there with uh, Duarte I tried to run towards him tried to like set some pressure but he played an LBY pass there to uh, to Kishna who goes through and he actually makes it 1-1 to make it all even uh, just before the game was about to end and you can see from the final stats uh, we had a little bit less possession but we had a lot of chances but again we simply couldn't finish them off which, uh, which was a big shame so um, I decided to make some changes I decided to bring on Kishna also second in form Danilo and also Wellington Silva to see if we can maybe uh, do some damage with uh, with them uh, then uh, into uh, into extra time we have uh, Wellington Silva there on the ball I tried to cross it over to Chikawi we wanted to decide Ways volley, then we pick it up with Chikawi and we make it 2 1 to pick up his third goal in total and also give us a lead back again. Then uh, in the 119th event, I tried to go for another skill goal there with Chikawi. A great tackle from my opponent. Then we pick it up with Kishna. We took the shot out with Danilo with his weak foot. And then look at that for a goal. I mean, how lucky can you get actually? Like the goalkeeper saved it, but then it still went in. So um, yeah, that is uh, that is pretty much how the game ended. We uh, we ended up winning 3-1, to one, which I think is more than deserved, especially if you base it on the stats. But anyway, we continue on into the second game where we actually came against a full club team. That is a Watford team in the 3-4-1-2 Formation. And I said this thing many times before in uh, previous videos that I really, really find it difficult to play against full club teams. And uh, this was actually one, so I, I knew from the beginning that it was going to be difficult, even though uh, the players weren't really that amazing. And uh, you can see in the sixth minute, we already picked up a free kick there. Uh, really really close to the box and I decided to go with something different I decided to play it off to Shikawi go with some skill moves try to finish it off there which uh, which is a free kick we have never really scored before as well I thought it would be a great opportunity since it was pretty close to the box but uh, I think his defender or goalkeeper just saved it but then in the 15th minute he also picked up a free kick and he actually scored from it with a header to uh, to make it 1-0 and I actually give him the early lead then uh, we continue on in the 18th minute we have uh, Chimiento there on the ball we play it off to Ben, ben Atira, who cuts inside with a nice and who actually finish it off there as well but then the referee decided to blow in his whistle and actually decide to give uh, give a foul against us and also on top of that he also gave a yellow card to Ben Atira, which I did not really understand and then a couple of minutes later again he picked up a free kick which uh, which hit my player and then I don't know how it went in but again he was completely free a header to make it 2-0 so all of a sudden we were 2-0 down which I did not expect at all especially the way we were playing we uh, we created some chances uh, I don't think it was necessary to actually like go down by two goals a uh, nice effort there from, from Rodriguez a nice long shot which uh, could have been an awesome goal uh, then we continue on uh, into the second half uh, we have Pereira on the ball a beautiful pass there all the way to Caresma where we managed to keep it in uh, we get past his defender then we get past another one with a ball roll we almost get tackled off the ball but then we finish it off there into the top corner with his weak foot and uh, we actually do get a goal back to sort of get us back into the game as well then uh, some nice stuff from Shikawi I was trying to go for a long shot but then for some reason he went with a slide tackle which uh, looked a bit weird another chance maybe a little bit too much with the skill moves uh, because the defender actually uh, defended it quite easily then uh, in the 58th minute pretty much on the counter attack he passed it across to Vidra and uh, he actually makes it 3-1. So at this point, I actually thought it was game over simply because we we were just unable to finish off our chances, which was very, very frustrating. Uh, 71st minute, he got himself a big chance as well after I think we went on ultra attacking or something since, uh, yeah, we were two goals down. I tried to create something, but didn't really work out that well. And also in the 78th minute, we... Uh, 
yeah, we actually gave away a penalty. You can see right there, I think Opara also hit the ball. I think it was a little bit uh, too harsh for a penalty, but he decided to uh, to step up right there with a striker. But this time, Howard actually managed to save it, which uh, sort of still gave us a chance to get back into the game. Then uh, he picked up another corner there. I think he went with a low pass there to a striker. We managed to intercept, but then we went on the counter-attack immediately. A nice pass from Cimento all the way to Chikawi, and I did not really think of any skin or something just because... I just want to get back into the game, especially since we only had 8 minutes left. And uh, we actually got ourselves another call there with Shikawi to, uh, to make it 3-2. And then in the 88th minute, we picked up a free kick. And guess what? We also put that one into the top corner with Rodriguez to, uh, to pick up the first free kick. And also make it all even just before the game was about to end. Just a crazy few minutes, especially for us, since uh, this actually meant we, uh, we sort of pushed ourselves until extra time. But we were still in the 90th minute. We still had one more chance. Uh, we have Ben Atira there on the ball. We tried to go with some skin moves. I think I tried a little bit too much there because you can see right there. I probably maybe, maybe could have passed it over to Shikawi or something. But that spin was, uh, was I think, a little bit too much. But anyway, he went on the counter-attack there with his uh, right mid. We uh, we intercepted there with Rodriguez. We played it off to Barami. A nice skin with the beat as defender. We played it off to Shikawi. And I look at that for a dirty tackle from behind. I think that should have been a red card. But the referee decided to give him a yellow. Which uh, which was fair enough, I guess. So um, we picked up another free kick. I decided to switch it over to Karesma with 99 curve. And guess what? We also put it into the back of the net to actually make it 4-3. In the 90th minute, in uh, in extra time, pretty much we uh, we secured a win, which uh, which I did not expect at all, especially when we were three one down. We uh, we gave away a penalty, we saved that one, and we got ourselves back into the game. Just a crazy game overall. So um, yeah, we move on to the skillers up. You can see right there we have uh, 13 games left. We also got three goals so far with Chikawi, which is not too bad. I can see from the challenges uh, so far we haven't completed any yet, but we were pretty close with the uh, with the free kicks one. So um, yeah, hopefully in the next episode or something we can uh, we can maybe complete the challenge as well. Would be nice. But uh, anyway, guys, that's pretty much going to be the end of this video. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then make sure to leave a like. Would be very much appreciated. And if you can get 2,000 likes that would be absolutely awesome so i'd like to thank you very much for watching and i'll see you guys later bye bye